There's been a lot of buzz about solid-state batteries potentially replacing lithium batteries in electric vehicles, EVs, soon. However, a new AI analysis platform, which forecasts technological advances based on global patent data, challenges this view. It suggests that graphene could be the next major breakthrough and might revolutionize the EV battery market in the near future. This raises questions about the future of solid-state batteries and the companies investing in their development. Join us as we explore these developments. As the world transitions to electric vehicles to reduce pollution, finding the ideal EV battery, one that is cost-effective, energy-dense, safe, and eco-friendly, has become a competitive race. Currently, lithium-ion batteries dominate the market, though their position is likely to endure for some time. Sodium-ion batteries offer a more affordable and environmentally friendly option for certain applications. However, the real innovations may come from emerging technologies like graphene and dual-ion batteries, which are still in the works. According to a new study by Focus, an artificial intelligence company that predicts future inventions, graphene batteries could be the next big thing in EVs by the 2030s. This is because the cost of making graphene, a key material in these batteries, is expected to drop dramatically. Graphene batteries could significantly improve how far EVs can travel on a single charge and help us reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Basically, they're a win-win for both drivers and the environment. As Jar Vannon, the CEO of Focus, says, graphene is the battery technology to watch. It has the potential to revolutionize the EV industry and make electric cars even more attractive. Focus analyzes the current state of EV battery chemistries and forecasts which ones look set to dominate in the coming years. Focus employs a three-pronged AI approach to dissect the ever-evolving landscape of EV battery technology. First, large language models act as super-powered research assistants. They delve into massive archives of global patents, meticulously searching for hidden gems and clues about promising new battery technologies. These AI researchers then meticulously compare and score these discoveries, identifying the most groundbreaking ideas with the most potential. Secondly, a real-time innovation tracker powered by Vector joins the investigation. This AI detective is constantly on the lookout for the latest breakthroughs and trends in battery research happening around the globe. It acts like a vigilant observer, keeping a watchful eye on the ever-changing landscape of battery technology. Finally, a third AI technique called multivariate regression steps in as the resident fortune teller. This powerful tool analyzes the data collected by the other AI researchers and predicts how different battery technologies will perform in the future. It considers factors like cost-effectiveness and real-world application to paint a picture of what's to come. According to Kaper Gorski, head of operations at Focus, the ideal EV battery needs to achieve a perfect balance of four crucial characteristics. The first is energy density. This refers to how much power a battery can store in a compact space. Imagine a car battery with the same power as today's models, but small enough to fit in your pocket. That's the dream of high energy density. Safety is paramount. No one wants an electric car battery that poses a potential explosion risk. Focus helps identify technologies that prioritize safety without compromising performance. Cost is another critical factor. Affordable batteries are essential for making electric cars accessible to a wider range of consumers. Focus helps us understand which battery technologies are becoming more cost-effective, paving the way for a more affordable electric future. Finally, sustainability is a top concern. We don't want batteries that leave a negative footprint on the environment. Focus sheds light on battery chemistries that utilize sustainable materials and prioritize efficient recycling processes. This indicates that solid-state technology may not be the immediate game-changer as some predicted. The story is similar for sodium batteries, another technology generating buzz. While they boast a promising 33% year-on-year improvement rate, it falls within the margin of error compared to LFP batteries. Focus highlights a key limitation of sodium batteries, their energy density. This translates to shorter driving ranges for EVs if the battery becomes too heavy. However, sodium's potential shines in stationary storage applications where weight isn't a concern. For relatively cheap grid-scale batteries, sodium makes perfect sense. However, 
they are overshadowed by the staggering advancements of graphene, 48.8% year-on-year improvement, and dual-ion batteries, 48.5% year-on-year improvement. Focus highlights these latter two as potential disruptors due to their improvement rates significantly exceeding established technologies. The consistent and substantial lead that graphene and dual-ion batteries hold suggests they have the potential to revolutionize the market. The two front-runners focus believes graphene holds the edge. The research surrounding graphene is more developed and the element itself is more readily available. This technology promises a significant leap forward for EVs, boasting high energy densities, extended cycle life, the number of times a battery can be charged and discharged before losing performance, and rapid charging capabilities. The current Achilles heel of graphene batteries is their prohibitive cost, stemming from the high price of producing graphene. At its core, graphene is a very basic material derived from any carbon source explains Van Enen. The raw material itself is abundant, but the process of transforming it into usable graphene is the bottleneck. Current production methods are simply too expensive for graphene batteries to disrupt the EV market. The cost of graphene production must come down significantly. Graphene is currently produced at around $200,000 per ton or $200 per kilogram. It is difficult to predict how cheap production needs to be before manufacturers start to use it in their batteries, but Focus believes this will happen when graphene becomes comparable with lithium. Lithium carbonate currently costs around $60 per kilogram to produce, and analysts believe it could fall a further 30% to $11 per kilogram in 2024. Focus's forecasting method estimates the improvement speed of graphene production at 36.5% year-on-year improvement. So assuming the current price of $200 per kilogram and a target price of $1 per kilogram, Focus forecasts graphene production will become cheap enough for the material to force its way into battery chemistries by around 2031. The race to unlock the potential of graphene batteries is heating up, with around 300 organizations now actively involved, according to Focus. Among these, 10 companies stand out as the front runners, with the potential to disrupt the battery market. Focus identifies Global Graphene Group as the leader in this pack. Their subsidiary Honeycomb Battery Company recently made a strategic move by announcing a landmark merger with Nubia Brand International. This collaboration aims to supercharge Honeycomb's manufacturing and research capabilities with a clear focus on developing advanced battery technology for electric vehicles.